What's going on guys, how are we going on? Back with another video. Today we're going to be showing you guys some more Clash Royale. <laughs> My dog's just scratching her ass. I, I just couldn't bear to laugh and I don't know, where were we? Anyways, uh, there are some packs in the shop that I wanted to go ahead and buy today. We have the $5 pack, we have 10 bucks, and then we have $20 that has some pretty decent gold. And if you guys don't know me, I'm sure you do, or maybe you don't, but I have a lot of cars that need to go to the next level. I never have gold, I just, I'm always broke. So yeah, these packs are definitely something that I want to go ahead and get, and yeah, so, Let's get into it. We're going to do a couple of battles. We're going to buy these packs and just chill for a bit. Okay, so the first thing I want to go ahead and do is get some of this stuff right here in the shop. We have some giants. Okay, um, that's about it. Actually, let me close the window because it's, <laughs> I know it's going to be really loud in a second. So, BRB. All right, so where were we? I'm gonna go ahead and go with a magical chest first. I might have to blur out the screen for a second because I have my email there and sometimes people like to try and hack emails for some reason. So let's go with the $10 right here. And do I have enough money? Um, you never know. Sometimes my bank says negative five. All right, so let's go ahead and click on okay and see what this chest has right here. So 1,200 gold. We have some archers, furnace, skeleton barrel. That's pretty good because Mines is like level three. We have some dank heels, uh, dark goblin, and four dark prince. Not too bad of a chest, but uh, oh, we can. Oh, never mind. For a second, I thought that we can buy multiple packs, but yeah, it's only one. So let's go with the giant chest right here. Now this one is just 500 gems and a giant chest, so nothing too surprising. 800 gold right here. We have barbarians, a freeze. Goblins and three musketeers. So the last pack is going to be the 100,000 gold and the 2,500 gems and I want to go ahead and buy that right after a battle. I'm just kidding. Don't skip the video let's, let's just get right into it. Now this one is obviously the most expensive one But is it worth it? In my opinion, it kind of is. I mean you get a decent amount of gems and gold You know that amount of gold costs uh, 4,500 gems so you're definitely getting some type of value here. And obviously, since we have that many gems, we can go ahead and buy some magical chests. So first of all, I do want this pack right here. It is five skeleton army. All right, so with our first magical chest, it is 870 each. We have some gold, Mega Minion, Hog Rider, Inferno Tower. I don't really feel like taking my time here. I just kind of in a rush. I drank some coffee and I'm like super hyper right now. We have some witches and we have three goblin barrels. So let's keep going here until we have no more gems. See if we can get a legendary somewhere. Uh, <laughs> no legendary yet. Come on, Supercell, just give me one today. I need a good thumbnail, you know what I mean? Here's the third one here, Skeleton Barrels. That's pretty good, at least we're getting some Skeleton Barrels. Uh, Fireball and Cannon Carts. I think this one might be the last magical chest. 1200 gold. We have Knight's Skeleton Barrel, Minion Horn, Range. Skeleton army and whoa, we got one legendary. What can it be? Go ahead and comment down below what you think it's going to be. So let's go ahead and screenshot this for just a second. Please don't turn off. Thank you. Sometimes I turn off the iPad by accident. <laughs> it's the worst thing. Anyways, in my opinion, I think it's going to be something I don't want. Every time I record, I get something that I just don't want. Like Lava Hound, Inferno Dragon, what else? Uh, Sparky. But let's see if we can get something that we actually want. So it is going to be... It's... Uh, Electro Wizard. Alright, we need one more to level 3, so that's pretty good right there. That is something I did not expect. In fact, I actually forgot this existed. Yeah, I need to play the game a little more. So that's pretty good. We basically got a free legendary because we got the pack. Well, actually, no, never mind. We used our money to buy these packs, but still, uh, the gems that we got from the packs, we got some chests and we got a legendary. So, but look at the gold we have. God damn, 140,000 gold. That's a lot. So what I want to do now is upgrade some cards that I actually use. So first, uh, just go through your deck, see what you need. Um, ooh. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't use this deck. I don't even remember making this deck. So let's pass. Um, let's see what we need, actually. So first of all, I want to get this up as high as possible because it's kind of cheap. There we go. Level six. And next up is going to be the Inferno Tower to level nine because we definitely do use that in battles. 
of course, to go against the Golem, Lava Hound, you know the deal. Next Huang is going to be the Royal Giant, obviously, I kind of want to get that maxed out. I'm just kidding, don't hate me. I don't use the Royal Giant, so... Let's go with the witch right here to level 5, and I want to do the darts goblin to level 9, as well as the battle ram. Man, we got a lot of gold still, so let's go ahead and do the ice golem to level 9. Next up is going to be the tombstone, which is probably something you don't want to do first, but hey, I have a lot of extra gold, so... We can do one more rare or maybe just like two more epics. I don't know. All right, let's do the rage to level five and one more card. What will it be? Oh, wow. My flying machine is level six. God damn. You know what? I kind of feel bad for the flying machine. So let's do that to level seven. And I think that's about it for all the upgrading. I kind of want to save some gold for some future, I don't know, cards that are in the shop. You know what I mean? So... Yeah, let's go ahead and hop into some battles now. So we're gonna be using this deck right here. It is my favorite golem deck. I feel like every video I have this deck, you guys, you guys are probably bored of it, but let's go. Whoops, where am I going? Let's go to 2v2, play with a friend, and share it to the client and see who accepts. It is probably going to be Durance, but I don't know. Did he go to sleep? Okay, well, uh Nobody likes me anymore. Guess it's time to move on. Different clan. Alright, you know what? Let's cancel this. Oh, oh wait, hold on. Oh, Cancel button didn't work, but we got into a match with Ronnie the Beast 10. All right, so let's see how we do this. Let's drop our, let me just pick up my iPad because I've been like, it's been on my cardboard stand here. All right, so electric collector, let's drop the goblin gang here to help with, oh, okay, rocket. Now, one thing they probably should have done is taking care of the push on the right side. It's not looking so good for them because a lava hound is right there and all they cared about was the rocket and the electric collector, so no bueno. Okay, now they just throw another rocket on. Okay, the newbiness can't get more real than that. All right, so they have a Mega Knight here. I completely forgot the Mega Knight does splash damage, which is something I hate. But Goblin Gang to take care of the princess because there seems to be nobody over there for some reason. All right, so at least we're in a lead here. The right tower is down to 1450, so let's go ahead and drop another electric collector on the right side because... If they drop a rocket, then you're pretty much just wasting elixir because, you know, this tower has 3k. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and he missed. Oh my god. He missed the... <laughs> oh, he missed the elixir collector. How hard is it to aim so that you hit... <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> it, it seems to be getting more common. Maybe it's a sickness. Chief Padman, I don't know what you did, but everybody seems to be missing rockets now. Oh, there goes another rocket, hey. Now, I guess the only reason why we're not winning here, or at least going faster than I thought I was, is because the damn rockets. They're throwing rockets at everything we have, which is kind of annoying, so I uh, could have used a log. All right, so Lava Hound in the bridge. Let's throw the Night Witch, and let's just throw everything. I think this game is GG already, I don't think, unless they have another rocket hidden somewhere in there. Uh, okay, anyways, I did have like a lightning, so either way, we were going to win this battle. There goes two rockets on the left tower. I had to cut that part out because I was almost going to swear. I don't like to swear on my channel. Sometimes, some videos, but yeah, um, nothing really happened. They just threw two rockets on my tower and then a goblin barrel, and that's how they got the left tower. So either way, it looks like we're going to be winning because the left tower is looking Overload it, and there we go, we won. That is pretty much it, so good game. Let's go ahead and go back home and see if we can go for another battle, and then that's pretty much it for this video. I don't want to make it too long or too short, because my last two videos were like four minutes long, and yeah, that's not me. I usually kick back, relax, and do some battles, so let's see if we can go ahead and do another battle, and hopefully this is the last one. Okay, so we're off to a fireball hitting the King Tower, and... The Elixir Collector. I, what, is, what is wrong with people's aim nowadays? Missing rockets, hitting the King Tower. Man, can't get any better than this. All right, so the P.E.K.K.A. did not make it to the tower. That's pretty good. And the Wizard will get distracted by the Night Witch. So we're off to a good start, kind of. Our tower, okay, never mind. Our tower is down to 2300. <laughs> I don't know how that happened, but all right, so let's go ahead and throw a log to get all those fire spirits. Ooh, man, that was a pretty impressive log. Okay, so we're 30 seconds away from the overtime, but I think I want to try to drop my golem right now to see if we can somehow succeed 
with a small push. I know it's a bit early for a push, considering that they do have a P.E.K.K.A., but, you know, um, it's worth a shot. Let's go ahead and see if we can do this. So we have a Mega Knight, a Golem, they have Elite Barbarians, okay. Um, it's 2017, but, okay. I'm just saying, Elite Barbarians used to be like that cool trend back in 2016, you know what I mean? Everybody was using Elite Barbarians, it was so OP, but nowadays it's just like, Oh, cool. Elite Barbarians. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Because I don't see them much up here. And, like, after you get to 4k, you don't see Elite Barbarians much. Alright, that push was pretty horrible, but let's try again with our Golem in the back right here. So we have... Oh, whoa. Actually, we're in the overtime already. I'm in two Elixir now, overtime. So let's go ahead and drop the Night Witch right here. And it looks like their P.E.K.K.A. is probably going to ruin our push. And that Tornado and the Fireball, yeah. You know what? This is probably going to be a tie. The tornado and fireball type thing is just kind of ruining our push right here. So I don't think they're going to win either because um, we do have some pretty good defense. So yeah, I don't think you're going to win, but let's just keep trying here. Uh, there, there we go with that tornado again. It looks like they're just dropping tornadoes and tornadoes and that's it. A tie is better than a loss though. So I will take that L gladly. Um, 15 seconds left on this match, and yeah, I think that's pretty much it for the game, so pretty good game at least. It wasn't that bad, it's just that the tornado and their fireball combo is just kind of ruining our push. The tornado does do some damage, and with the fireball combined with that, it just ruins pushes, so... That is pretty much it for this game right here, let's go back, and uh, yeah, so... That should be it for the video as well. I really do hope you guys enjoyed, and also I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving yesterday. Today's Friday. Yesterday was Thanksgiving, unless you live in, I don't know, Australia. But Australia doesn't have any Thanksgiving, so I don't know what I'm saying. But I really do hope you guys enjoyed, and I want to thank you all for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Tell me what you guys think below in the comment section of YouTube. See you on the next one.